Hey guys, Recruiter here, uh, bringing you the new bypass. Um, I'm going to call the bypass the proxy bypass because you use a uh, proxy server to bypass uh, the game or any other games. Like this, this isn't simply for COD 4, this does everything, you know, uh, Modern Warfare 2, any game you think of, right? So yeah, it's going to be quite helpful if for hacks in the future and stuff. Um, everything you need will be in the description. Uh, all the links, all the stuff. I'm going to try and make this as simple as possible. don't want to drone on, so yeah, let's just get started. <coughs> Alright, so open up your browser. doesn't really matter what one you're using. I'm using Safari because it's the fastest. And you're going to want to go to this link. The link will be in the description. Just pop that in there. Alright, so you'll come to a site that looks like this. Pretty straightforward, just hit the download button, big green button there on the screen. Um, no viruses whatsoever, I can assure you that. Just hit the save button. Let it download, it's quite a fast download. It's not a big file, only 3 megabyte. Um, just waiting for this. Come on. Thank you. Right. Just got to pull this onto my uh, desktop. It already is on my desktop. Wow, I'm a dick. Right, so you can close this now. Uh, open up the installation. Here we are. Your security will probably say that. Doesn't matter. Just hit the run button. Next, next, next. Wait for this to finish. This little black thing will pop up and go away. Don't need to worry about that. Trust me on this. Alright. So you'll be directed to this site. Um, all, this is so, it looks so complicated, but actually isn't. See all the wee X's? Just click all the wee X's. Install them. And then hit the save button. That will save. Just waiting for that. My internet's going really slow today. Don't know why. Alright. So that's that. The next step you want to do is click this button over here. Configure, and this is the uh, probably the main part. Do this. Um, can't remember if that's block. Probably is block. And then uh, uh, this will be in the description. Also, this little code right here. Just paste that in there like that. Hit the save button. Let it save, and that's it. You're done. Finished completely. Just close that. You can close this. You can delete this if you want to. Um, yeah, that, that's pretty much it. The proxy hack. It's not a hack, it's a bypass, sorry. Um, so yeah, I'll just quickly go over to the PS3 to show you what you have to do next. And yeah. Sorry, I actually forgot to show you how to obtain your IP address. It's uh, important for the PS3 part of the bypass. So yeah, just click your start button. And right here, type in CMD, like so, and then just hit enter. And then you get this little black box command uh, area. And then pretty much just type in ipconfig, just like that. See that? And then hit enter. Okay, and that will find you your IP address. The one you're looking for is this one. The I think that's an I, yeah, IPv4. <laughs> that's hard to say. IP V4 address. That's the one you're looking for. Uh, mine's covered at the moment, just for security reasons. Uh, don't want to get hacked. But yeah, that's um, that's that's what you're going to be needing for the next part of the video. Okay, so now we're finally on the PS3 after a mistake which I corrected, but. Yeah, so just go to settings, and then go down to uh, network settings, and then go into network settings, and then go into internet connection settings. Alright, now go to custom. Just go across, use whatever internet you're using, and then when you finally make it over to proxy server, put proxy server to use. Make sure it's on use. Alright, so go into that. And then this is where you're going to want to put in your IP address that we found earlier. So I'm just going to quickly pop mine in. For security reasons, just going to pan and crop all over the place. Make sure your port is 0808 or whatever it said in the video there. Just use my port. It will work. Um, so yeah, just 
hit that, enter that, and then don't you don't need the test connection. But if you want to test the connection, go ahead. So yeah, just wait to sign in. If you've if you manage to sign in, that means you've done it properly and it will work. Yeah, have signed in on a proxy server. Uh, just gonna <coughs> put my hack on here. Everyone's seen that their picture before. Let's load this. And into COD 4. I have deleted the patch. <coughs> I know I didn't show that in the video, but I have deleted the patch. Make sure you delete the patch, that's an important part of it. You'll find that in the game data utility on the games menu. And yeah, just start up COD 4 normally the way you would. I somehow get spammed by chat invitations there. But yeah, thanks. Just as we have the time here, uh, I'd like to thank everyone who subscribed to me. Uh, I think I'm on like 1,500 subscribers or something close to that. Uh, yeah, so I'm, I'm grateful, grateful for that. Um, yeah. So yeah. So yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, just go to multiplayer. Go to multiplayer. I'm actually having some of my coke. My Belfry doesn't. Uh, okay, just wait here. Twenty seconds. I mean, you don't have to do this according to some hacks, <coughs> but yeah, for my pro mod hack, you have to wait at least twenty seconds to allow leaning and stuff to load properly. So, and um, after you do this bypass, make sure you use the hack, my six point zero hack, which is in the description of this video. That's important because the hack that I released for my resistance full man version isn't going to work on this bypass. I'd just like to make that incredibly clear right now. If you're going to use new hacks, make sure you use the new hacks in my file because my file's been updated and set for this bypass. Okay, you should get that. You're not retarded. Um, so I'm just going to prove to you that it has worked real quick. So yeah, clearly Downpour doesn't normally look like that. This is the Pro Mod Hack 6.0. And yeah, just gotta show you that it is working. I'm not getting signed out. Uh, I'm gonna leave this video playing a wee while, not long, just a wee while, just to show to you that you don't actually get signed out. Okay, so thanks for watching guys. Please rate this video. Um, comment if you have any questions you need help or whatever I'll I'll try and help you and uh, yeah thanks for watching